Yes, I stand with Texas. Yes, I support Texas. And what we're about to chew on, I think there's only two reviews of this on all of YouTube. And no, I didn't have to get it sourced. This was in my local area. The only two dippers that's got it, I know on here for sure, is, and one of them don't even make dip videos anymore, Birds Dip Reviews and Soup Dip and Chew Guy. And I think they're both from three years ago each, or at least a little bit farther back. And that would be, ooh, Bloodhound. A doggone good chew. Plug chewing tobacco. 59% U.S., 41% imported tobacco. Sales only allowed in the United States. American Sniff Company, manufactured by American Sniff Company, LLC, Memphis, Tennessee, which is now in Clarksville, Tennessee, but not at the time that this one was produced. And there it says it. Also right there it says Dick Cut. Dick Cut 2 right there. Morning label, blah, blah, blah. Also, in the last live vibe on Friday, if you was watching everybody, Outlaw was in there, of course. But I don't think he stayed in there very long. Which I can understand because he's a busy, busy man. He's a busy man. Of course, he's got that wrapper around it. Which we're going to have to pull off. Because I ain't chewing that wrapper. That's what it looks like medium to blondish dark tobacco. Real sweet, but more like a mammoth cage, more like a toy smell. That it would up loose leaf would smell like. More robust. But, you gotta give two points here. It's fresh. Which I was surprised. Calls. This was made in Memphis. Spit on the first one. Of course, they ain't gonna be as dark starting out. So, it's three out of ten. Taste ten out of ten. Mellow chew is what I'm getting off of it so far. Mellow taste. A robust taste, more robust than even twist. Darker now. Tastes like an aromatic cigar to me. Could be wrong on that. But what's y'all thoughts on that scummer or chummer? Yeah. Chummer guy. Now talking about Zen and Van Zen. Here's my thoughts. I ain't seen anything they would do to promote it towards teenagers, unlike maybe Jewel or Vapes. Yeah, real good dark spit. Uh, but back to the topic of Zenarellos. Zens, I mean. <laughs> but yeah, Zens ain't even really that pungent in taste. No, you don't really get that much, I don't think, of taste. Off of Zen's even. But each to their own. Initial ratings now into it. 10 out of 10 on taste. 10 to 10 out of chew. 10 to 10 out of staying in the mouth. Good. So overall, an extremely good chew. I chew it again. I've done had it three different times. So. Well worth it in my opinion. Of course that's probably going to be as much as America Best. Which used to be 
aka Red Man. But that's probably going to last you too. Longer than dip if you dip more so. Oh, there's that. And I want to give a shout out to Chris Dips One as always. And I'm filming this on a Sunday night. And to all my live vibers out there, keep on vibing. Stay positive. And catch you tomorrow on the live vibe, y'all.